welcome to West Himmerland's museum, Aarhus in Denmark. We're standing next to a very beautiful replica of the famous and well-debated silver cauldron from Gunterstrup. The cauldron was found in 1891 by a uh, peat worker, Jens Sørensen, and he brought it into to his master uh, and uh, they had it delivered to the National Museum. It weighs about nine kilos of pure silver and uh, it, it, on it is depicted a lot of scenes from the Greco-barbarian world of, of symbolism. There are 13 silver plates in all depicting scenes from the world of gods and humans and there are a very selection of animals depicted here as well. We see elephants, we see tigers, we see lions and so on. We even have scenes where we can see what we, what we think is Orpheus uh, singing to the animals, which is showing back to the Greek world. Also, there is a very important offering scene showing people being dumped into a cauldron very much like this. The use of this silver cauldron could be the same offering of humans and their blood, perhaps. We don't know for sure, but it's a very good guess. Originally, this cauldron was produced in Bulgaria in the uh, Varna area for some of the rulers that were there about, uh, just before Christ or a few hundred years before Christ. But how it, it ended up in Denmark, well, we don't know. Perhaps the Cimbrians brought it here on their return, if there were any returning Cimbrians. But it ended up here and was put in the bug around 100 AD. That we know from the carbon-14 datings that was uh, taken from some pollen uh, in the wax, in, in some wax that were found on the, on the plates. Why here in near Aarhus? Why put, why put this cauldron in the Revemusen? Well, at that time, around the birth of Christ, we see a, mass, a lot of villages and farmsteads around Aarhus. And a very dense population must have been here. Some of them must have been high-ranking persons. And one of them might have been the one who brought this cauldron back to Denmark and put it in the bog just to show his own power. There are several other very nice finds in the, the area, uh, but this is, of course, the best. But uh, some mighty chieftains could sit around Aarhus at that time. And now I've brought you to the actual find spot of the Gunterstrup Cauldron. In 1938, a memorial stone was placed here to pinpoint where it was found. So. This is it. You may find it yourself and you will be welcome. Mm -hmm.